see how it just sprayed a little bit see ta-da you see how shiny it got welcome back to my youtube channel um as you can see by the title this vlog is going to be about my perfume um you guys have been asking me about my perfume collection for a very long time and i will always just post it but i would never like show you each perfume and the scents what they smell like and when you should wear them and you know the vibe um for the perfumes so we're gonna get straight into this video if you are new here make sure you like comment and subscribe and all my people that have been supporting me i love you guys so much um and yeah we're gonna get straight into this video let me adjust my camera because it's too high okay this is perfect so this is what my collection is like y'all i am in my kitchen um because i wanted to do like a new new scenery i'm always like in my glam room like in my little glam section so i was like you know what i'm gonna do something different this time um but this is how my collection looks um if you can't see and y'all it's already full um it's nothing that, like nothing else can fit in here i even have the samples on the side like and i got this glass um tray i got it from amazon i can't remember the name of the tray i don't know if i find it by the time i edit this vlog i'll drop it down in the description but if you, you could do like a glass um tray and it should come up because it's like glass and it's a mirror too so at the bottom it's a mirror so you can see yourself um okay so we're gonna get straight into it i have the first one we're gonna do is the baccarat which is the 540 i this is um wait i think this is the body oil yeah this is the body oil so it's like real shiny excuse me y'all i live in the city so but this is what it looks like um this is like the body oil i use so like you know vacation trips or if you weren't wearing something like you know sexy and you showing skin i feel like you should put oil like right here or you know areas like that that you're showing the skin especially on vacation and bikinis i feel like you should always have oil so it smells exactly like the perfume i have a candle too y'all make sure i to make sure I show you guys at the end. But I have a candle and it's crazy. I really love this scent. Then here is the actual perfume. Um, as you can see, I've used that. <laughs> and I also have another one, the same exact one. And as you can see, it's only a little bit in here. But a little goes a long way. You don't have to spray a lot. And what helps me is I spray when I get out the shower because I wear perfume to bed. Don't judge me. I don't know why it's just a habit um but when i get out the shower i just always like spray the perfume all on me so it can kind of like soak into my body and then i kind of like instead of drying off i kind of like pat dry to make sure it's in there so i always do it i wouldn't be like completely wet but um i would just make sure like i'm damp and you know and spray it on me to me that makes a difference because I feel like when you spray perfume on your clothes and like on dry skin, it kind of like don't get into your skin. So it's like, it's just on top of your skin and eventually I feel like it fades away. I don't know, that's just my theory, what I think. Then I have this, I showed this in one of my vlogs and y'all, I pronounced this so wrong. I don't know why I said Satan, but it's Satin. It's S-A-T-I-N. I don't know why I said it in my last vlog. I must have spray shit, it didn't really look, but because it's in cursive, but it's um, the Satin Mood. And this smells good. So I feel like with Baccarat, it's really like sexy. Mm, it smells so good. Really sexy. But you can do a everyday wear with this because it's like real soft and calm. It's giving like, like sweet, soft, but like real sexy. And it still smells bomb. So I feel like this would be an everyday wear. The body oil, I feel like if you use the body oil, then you don't need a perfume. Because it's going to be like too much on you because the body oil is already on your body. Um, but with the the satin mood i feel like this is like i use this date night because it's like it's soft but it got a kind of strong kind of scent to it so i feel like this would be like date night all my perfumes are like soft scents and like things like that i don't do like strong scents and i don't like flowery scents but um yeah i would use this date night i always do date night 
with this. I don't know why. It's just like my go-to with date night, but it smells so good. And sometimes I mix these two and I put like, you know, both of them on and the combo is like really good. Okay, and then the next one we have, what is this? I don't know how to say this word. I think it's like Perel, I guess. Um, and I think I use this maybe I think I use this maybe one time, um, but to me, it's like a, now if anything smells flowery, I feel like this kind of smells flowery. Um, it smells like, I want to say like it's soft, but it smells kind of like flowery. And I don't know what type of mood I would have. I don't really, this is not really my favorite. It's probably my, my least favorite, everything else I love, but like this is kind of like strong. So I would probably do this like, hmm. You can also do this date night, but I wouldn't do too much. But um, I don't know. Like, I feel like I would do date night, but I wouldn't do it every day wear with this. Like, this is just too much every day. Um, but it just depends on, like, your vibe and what you're going for. Then this is Miss Diora, the blue me. Um, I really love how it is, like, the bow and stuff. It's, like, really super cute. My man got me this one and another one and i got this for valentine's day i really love perfume um i really love perfume y'all so much but yeah this smells good i have been using this too mm. and it smells so good this is christian dior i've been using this a lot as you can see you see it right at the top but i also use this date night and this is an everyday wear it is so simple and soft like you can do this every day but i definitely do this sometimes with date night like if i don't want it to keep doing the baccarat i definitely do this this smells so good so this is like a must have like you gotta have this one you gotta have the baccarat but if you want like a everyday wear this is the key this one I'm trying to tell y'all um, then this is another one that I got from YSL, the black opium. Um, this is what it looks like. The bottle is like really cute and glittery. I really love that. Um, he got me this one as well. I keep forgetting how these scents smell. This one is smell good too. Wait, let me see. Yes, this one smell good too. This is an everyday wear. Um, but this is give like real rich. So I would do this like maybe like business meeting to work. Um, but you don't have to do this like every day. Um, yeah, this one smell good too. And then this one, y'all, I don't know. I guess it's the Eclat de Flores. I really don't know how to pronounce that. But this is what it looks like. Um, this this smells good, but it kind of gives like old woman. It gives like too strong. Like we put too much on, you know how like you sit around someone that's like elderly and they have like strong perfume on. This is what it smells like. So I wouldn't even suggest getting this. I was using it probably like two years ago and then I just stopped because I was like, I had to do like one sip of that. But I really love the bottle and it's really cute. And let's see. This one, the Daisy Love, the Marc Jacobs. This is a must. You gotta have Marc Jacobs. Like, it don't matter what scent you do. I feel like Marc Jacobs is a must have. Um, I really love this. It smells really good. And I love, like, I really would, I'm a sucker for perfume. So I would buy perfume um, like this, like bottles and stuff, just because it's cute, I'll get it. I, I'm like that with like everything. Like, I was in Target the other day and I needed some shampoo. And like I had seen like some cute bottles or whatever and I was telling my man I'm like let's get this one he was like you didn't even smell it I'm like but the bottle is cute so then he smelled it. he was like this smell like paint so he was, I was like well no I want to do this brand just because it smells so good we end up finding one and y'all the shampoo smells amazing like it smells so good but the bottle is so cute I had got I think it's like by Chris is it Christy or Christian the okay. cat i don't know but it smells really good and it really helps with my curls because i have kind of like heat damage right here where i have up just because i would like do my bangs a lot when i'm like having my sew-ins and then maybe like this piece a little bit because it's like in the front right here but yeah i really love my curls they're not dry i also use a leave-in conditioner too um with my curls and i'm just loving the curls it's skipping to the girls and I just was like, let me start wearing my hair curly more often because I want to stop wearing weave. And I love like this natural look ever since I got my hair cut. 
so and then for vacation um i was just like i want to wear my hair curly because i want to get in the water and you know do all that stuff so yeah i get carried away and i'm talking about something that doesn't have anything to do with the vlog so sorry but yeah mark jacobs um let's see i have another perfect mark mark jacobs and the bottle is so cute my stepdad got this for me for christmas um this one smells so good one day i had told them that i had mark jacobs and he had listened to me and then he went to get it for christmas and i have this ever since this one is really good too all mark jacobs stuff smell good but this is an everyday wear too i know i said this with a lot of these but that's because i do soft scents i don't do strong scents um but yeah this is an everyday too this is my go-to like I feel like when I don't when I don't want to use all my Baccarat or if I don't want to use all my Dior, then yeah, I will go to this one next. I lost my little black top to cover to go to it. I don't know where it's at. I think I threw it away. But this is the Valentino. Um, as you can see, I probably got like one spray out of this. I haven't really used it. Let me see. This one smells good. So this reminds me of the YSL. They kind of smell similar to me. Yeah, this is kind of like not a strong scent but um yeah it still smells good and it also smells like the satin mood it also smells like that too next we have the tyl okay so y'all i was on tiktok and i seen like i was just like looking up perfume collections because i just wanted to see like the scents on everybody and y'all this perfume i even ha i still have the box like I don't even want to go get it because it's in my closet up top but i still have the box and like the way it came in if you look this up and see it was like literally like you're getting a rolex box it was big um you open it up it's red in the inside and then it had this in the inside y'all oh my god this perfume was the most expensive perfume i've ever bought this was like $800 but it gives rich it gives really rich, sexy, bougie. Like when I say it's giving like, honey, when you walk in, they like, oh yeah, she smells like money. I'm telling y'all. I've used this maybe like one or two times, but I, I really, the reason why I don't use it a lot because it costs so much and the bottle is so pretty. I'm like, I cannot, I literally cannot, I cannot get, use all this. And then, you know, I got to get my money's worth. $800 is, is a lot, especially for perfume. Um, but yeah, this is really cute. I really love this one. Like if I had to pick anyone that would give us like real rich, this would be the one rich. I'm telling y'all. I'm not telling y'all to buy it because it's really expensive, but like maybe you should look up so their brand and see if they have other ones. But I'm telling y'all, it smells so good. Okay. Then the next one I would have is Bond number nine. You can never go wrong with Bond number nine um this one smells good too my face but then y'all like i this was like when i first started this is the gold coast when i first started getting perfume i really do the louis vuitton which i'm out of so i can't even show y'all that that was that's my favorite but i'd be out of it so much and i'd be like i'm not about to keep rebuying this but um yeah that was my favorite out of all perfumes that is my favorite and then wine number nine is my favorite but it's like over the years it started to smell like toilet water i don't know if it's just me let me know in the comments i don't know if it's just me or what but it started to smell like toilet water like the bathroom i don't know if it's because i've had it for so long and i'm just over the scent or what but i really love the bottles so even if i don't use them like that it's fine but this is not really my favorite and it still smells so good but that one kind of smells like toilet water y'all i don't know i really don't know but um oh and this is the new york the New York Knights, and then that one, this one is the Gold Coast. Okay, then we have my Coco Chanel, um, my body oil. This is another body oil, and it's like kind of shimmery too. So when you put it on, it's like real shiny. I really love this. If you wanted another body oil, I had the perfume to go to this the same time, um, but it had a hole in it and it kept dripping. I just throw it away i know it sounds crazy but i was just like yeah i'm over it and plus i didn't like the perfume it was just so fucking strong it was strong it smelled like an old lady but um yes if you want a body oil do this get this and all you do is just spray it it's just like the bottle is just like spray so you just spray it on yourself and then you kind of just rub it in so kind of like let's see 
see how it just sprayed a little bit see ta-da you see how shiny it got the light is kind of like messing it up but if i get you closer you see how you can see it's kind of like shiny so i do use it for vacation i always take that on trips just because i want to be shiny especially for my pictures and let's see so these are really not like my perfumes these are like sprays like room spray um these are like gifts that i got from like christmas or whatever my cousins got me so i use this like room spray or i would use it like in the bathroom but this one smells so good it smells so good it's sweet sunrise it smells good it's like a sweet type of scent so i use that for like room spray sometimes but if anything i use this too for room spray i got it from target and I use all types of room spray from Bath and Body Works, all that. And then this is what my nephew got me for Christmas, which is A Thousand Wishes. And it smells good too. That smells good too. So I kind of like, if I want to do like a body spray on my clothes, I do that like really quick or whatever. Maybe like we're gonna wait for a photo shoot, I will bring this along, but this is not my everyday wear. Um, and then I have like little samples that I would get when I would go get perfume. And this one is the 2 a.m. Kiss. I have not used this, so I don't know what it smells like. Oh, to me, it smells like a baby. It smells like a newborn baby. And newborn baby smells so good. Y'all, it smells just like a newborn baby. I am not lying. That is so crazy. Now it's like it makes me want to use it. Um... I keep my samples just because later on when I need some perfume ideas, I go. As you can see, I use literally almost all this. This is YSL. Uh, I think I actually have that. Oh no, I don't. So this is a YSL Moon Paris. Um, this is a Valentino Donna. I use that as well. Don't sleep on those whenever you give me that. This is the Chanel. Actually, this is, yeah, this is the Chance Chanel. I think this is the perfume that I had, but I used that too. Let's see. Uh, this is another YSL. I don't know what kind this is, but I've used this too, as you can see, half of it. I use my samples because, yeah. This is Yo Yomo. I've never heard of this. I think, I don't even know why I've used it. I probably just sprayed something real quick. Mm, I don't really like that. That's probably why I don't know what it is. Oh, and this is another YSL. It's called Intensement. Oh, it's the same one right there. So I've used that as well. And I put those all to the side. And that is all. That is my whole perfume collection. Um, if you guys have any favorites, let me know because I will literally get another tray and start adding more. Um, I just really love perfume and that is like the perfect gift to get for me, like perfume. As long as it smells good and you know, if you want to spend that type of money on me, that's cool. If not, I'm going to get it regardless, but you know, my birthday. That was embarrassing. But my birthday is coming up April 29th. And you know, if my friends is watching this, you know, I love perfume and all that types of good stuff. I love flowers, you know, things like that. It don't have to be just for my man, it could be from y'all, you know. Or you guys that's watching this supporters, you can send it to my PO box. And if you want to know my PO box, it is you just gonna have to say it in the comments or DM me on Instagram because I don't really know it by heart and I don't wanna give out the wrong address. But yeah, so if you guys have any favorite perfumes, um, room sprays, whatever, let me know. Drop them down in the comments, don't be shy. Don't be holding out because I'm giving y'all the goods, y'all should give me the goods because I really just love perfume. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I had took forever to do this, but I really, 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 have been tired um but yeah so i've done this i didn't drop last sunday because i was just super tired and y'all 
I had some other personal stuff going stuff going on, so I didn't want to film. Um, but yeah, I really love this video. Um, let me know if you guys decide to get these perfumes and let me know which ones were your favorite and which one that you would consider. Some of these are not as expensive as it may seem just because it's designer. And if you don't want to buy these, I feel like you should start small and you should go and look at alternatives um, just because some people don't want to spend that much on perfume and that and i get that because i don't even be wanting to spend much on this perfume and some of these are gifts so yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and we are at 700 subscribers i love you guys so much thank you for supporting me keep supporting me i really love y'all like i genuinely love y'all y'all support me like right or wrong y'all always support me and watch my videos and i appreciate y'all and that's who i do it for and yeah make sure you like comment and subscribe i love you guys so much and bye